Guys, we're going to be talking about what I got during my birthday, such as this merch. Merch! So that's not what we're going to talk about now. Right now, I'm going to talk about this. We're also going to, first before I show you anything else, and tell you what everything else about what I have here, um, make sure to like and subscribe and hit the bell icon before I forget to tell you later. Before you forget, okay? Okay. By the way, that creeper is also on my presents, and it was very fun. It was a pinata that they pulled. Okay, I will just explain it all later. So, oh yeah, I got multiple things, not just merchandise for my birthday. I got a bunch of other stuff. Like, most of the stuff I got were just cards. One of the most exciting things I got was a $20 gift card for Amazon. We sold it. We sold it as soon as we got it. Literally like a couple minutes after we got it. From my mom's friend. And so, yeah. Now I guess we should get started. I'm going to talk about this. And if you haven't already, I'm going to give you a second to think. If you need more time to think of who this is, I'll give you some more, you can pause the video. I'm not going to give you some more time, I'm just going to pause the video. And leave a like if you actually did manage to figure out who these were from. Okay, so this is a decapitated head, no, not really decapitated, as you can see there's nothing really here. This is a head of the odd ones out. So yeah. So, if he was an actual object and he was round, as you can see, this is what his head would be like. This is what his head would be like. Oh, sorry. Sorry. And by the way, guys, this is a decapitated head. extremely soft and as you can see he's also a very good squishy that is at, that is very squishable and very soft so it's very comfortable <laughs> so yeah this is all him and by the way, go check out The Odd Ones Out. He's a YouTuber animator. If you haven't heard of him, you're probably living underneath a rock. If you haven't heard of him, you're probably living underneath a rock. And so go check him out if you haven't already. If you haven't already, go check him out after this video. He's The Odd Ones Out. The Odd Ones Out. The Odd Ones Out. The Odd Ones Out. So that was one, and I'm going to put him right here. I'm going to put him right on top of my creeper. I'll tell you about him later. And so, yeah, I'm going to put him right there. Oh, sorry, sorry. I'm going to turn my piano off. Okay, get ready to do something real quick. He's just gonna be placed there for for most of, for the rest of the time. He's not gonna stay there for the entire time. I'm gonna have to move him just a slight bit so you guys can see him. So okay. Give me a second to get everything ready for the next guy. Next thing. Not guy thing. So yeah. God, there we go. Yes. Yes. So, if you haven't seen in the beginning of the video and you don't know who this guy is, again, I'm going to give you a couple seconds to. I'm going to give you a couple seconds to see who this is from. If you need to go from the beginning of the video or 
you see right here, it says common sense. Common sense. I'll show you better later. Okay, so I'm going to give you a couple seconds to show who this guy is. Okay. You have a guess it by now. He is the... And before I give you the answer, guys, I'm sorry about this. But if, before I give you the answer, you can pause, like, right now and continue thinking about it. Or if you have to look up or search anything. But please don't. Don't you ask. And if you don't get it, just, again, leave a like if you have it on the first one. So, okay. Common sense. Yeah, it's common sense. And this shirt... This sweatshirt is by the Odd Ones out if you haven't known him already. And he's also another YouTuber. So go check him go check them him out. He's extremely fun. Funny. So yeah, go check go check him out. He's a YouTuber animator. And again, if you don't know who he is, you're living under a tree, cause not that many people know who he is. So I'm going to quickly show you what it looks like without it, and yeah. So does it look good on me? Is it, is it looking on me? No. Okay, I'm going to quickly put it on, okay? Don't worry, I have a t-shirt underneath here, okay? Just, you can skip through. It's gonna be very fast, so don't skip through that far. Okay, guys, and here's what I look like. Ta-da! Common Sense Hooded, you <laughs> know, with the hoodie on. I'm a witch. Which house am I in in Harry Potter? Hufflepuff. Eh, my friend, my friend is an expert in, in basically Harry Potter. He's read every single book, watched basically every single movie except one. The very first. No, not the very first. Just one of them. I don't remember which one he didn't watch. He wanted to watch one. And he called me Hufflepuff since I have all the characteristics. I feel myself more of either a Slytherin or I feel myself a bit more Slytherin, but eh, I'm gonna take it from the expert and the one who actually has a hat that detects. It. Yeah, I'm gonna just take it from the expert, and I'm and I kind of actually now that I'm saying it out loud, I kind of sound like Hubble. I'm kind of more of Hubblepuff now that I think about it. So yeah, I guess you and I guess I'm gonna be wearing this the entire time. Next, next up is. The Creeper. Oh, man! I'm sorry about that. I'm really sorry. So, this guy, literally, I got put, this guy, as you can see, he's a piñata. And he was very fun. Oh, there's no candy in here? What the? Let's just get it up. So, okay. This guy was extremely fun. Say hi, Creepy. Say hi, Creepy. He's going to just let you know everything about Creepers. Everything about Creepers? No, he's just going to let you... No, Creep... Don't tell me... Don't tell them everything about Creepers. Tell them everything how my birthdays went down in Creeper Tongue. Which is actually called Creepening. 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 So I'm going to let him take the spotlight. Creepy! Get up for Creepy, folks! 
Clap, 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 Creep a tongue. Creep a tongue. Tell you what he said in creep a tongue. I mean, I'm gonna tell you what he said in ink. Tell you what he said in creep a tongue, but in actually in English. So, okay. So, okay. He said. Oh, sorry. Sorry. Wrong one. He said, well, uh, as soon as I got put up for a couple of hours, like. A day, a day, and a cup, and a couple more hours, like eleven. After that, the, every, I, everyone went outside for a piece of cake. Everyone came back in, not feeling so great. I saw the entire thing. He just went to his room to relax. A couple minutes more later, he came back with all of, with the entire family, right un, with him, right underneath me, with the entire family sitting down at the kitchen table. As soon as they sat down, Rifka, Rifka, which is his sister, and and Beth, also known as Ema, is his mother. And as soon as everyone sat down and those two got up, they pulled they pulled all the stuff out of me, and I exploded. I exploded from the bottom out with candy coming out all on top of him. And have you ever heard the song called? Oh, what a rain it would be, or it might be called gumdrops and lollipops. Gumdrops and lollipops, I can't exactly remember. But have you ever heard that song? Candy was falling from the sky onto him from my explosion hole and fell down on top of his head, but luckily he had a plate on him. And so, yeah, that's how he got, and that's how I've been here. Then after a couple of minutes, Evan took me back to his room, and I felt then he fell asleep. Same with me. I fell asleep a couple of minutes before him. So yeah, that's basically what happened. And yeah, I'm gonna quickly get the next item. It's like outside since it's super big. I'm gonna think. I'm gonna get the presents. Okay. So guys, I am sorry you could just have skipped through that. I'm gonna have to bring this guy with me for this. It's that big. You could just please just skip through that. That's just some secrets that you can't know. So yeah, I'm gonna just bring you to the spot. I'm just gonna. I need. I can't come. I can't bring it to you. So I'm going to bring the tree to you. Since I can't bring the tree to you, I'm bringing you to the tree. I mean, Ben. So, wait, I already scored up there. <laughs> ha. So, our secret. And my last.
Okay, so yeah, so this is what I got. If you didn't haven't read this, it is a tangerine tree, which I was extremely excited about. In about a year, which I and it will in about a year we'll be able to get blossoms, hopefully. In about a year hopefully we're gonna be able to get blossoms and eventually get our own tangerines. And yeah, it's pretty much it's so uh, I'm gonna bring you back inside. Also I got a bunch of books. Gonna do like comic graphic novels. And if you say graphic novels are just comic books, here's what I say to you. No, they're not. Comic books are short little stories like that. Graphic novels are big long stories filled with thick impacts. Guys, I'm gonna need you to get something. Okay? Let's go to the sister or something real quick. Okay, guys, as soon as you saw that, I'm sorry for the big short parts. I can't edit out since I don't know how. But, um, basically, I hope I can see you later. And, wait, what is that?